the surprise, Shinsei going to be coming out super aggressive. Just going to be hitting a couple of shots, but not going to be able to take him down. He's down to 16 HP. Somehow that shock dart does not actually take him out. Look at this war happening. What in the world? This looks like a death match right now. Somehow, there's only been two players taken out at this point when every single one of them was towards mid. Juicy does try to take, does actually end up taking Rivera, who was pushing up towards long. Three easy paths here towards that A site. Four versus three. Can they make this work? Juicy actually has that frenzy. Up close and personal, gonna be very dangerous. Clears out the corner with that. Spots out Maxi pushing up. He got the information. They have to be very careful. Darion comes in. And it's just trades all around the corner. The Frenzy's not going to be working here for the retake. And there it is. Bleed with the trades back and forth. They managed to pick up the first round. It's very, very dangerous. Oh, great concussion. Look at LVR just setting up the firing squad towards Long. Decent effort from the side of Bleed. They want to take the, the orb here to pick up an ultimate make their way closer but just does not work out Jay. setting their scopes here towards this a site information has been given shinsei trying to find an opening frag but couldn't decide who to shoot left. falls back and now waiting for the rest of the team to come in for the retake great shot here to start things off he's got three kills so far looking for the ace but no it's not going to work out but he has the information that both these two players are actually towards the hell position they do manage to get the spike down two versus two now Redco alongside Maxi, how will they turn this around? They've got two flashpoints to work with in this hand of Redco. That's going to be very big, but Jay manages to turn, set in the nick of time, and Darion comes back, gets the shot there on towards Redco, and holds things down. This is definitely doable here. Shinsei going to be coming in, just gets dodged. Just the little concussion gets the shot here on towards Crazy Guy. That's going to be a great start. Time is of the essence, and they look like they just want to go for the defuse instantly. Look at this crossfire that they have set up. There's just no way for Bleed to actually get this locked down in place. Oh my goodness. Oh man, Darion. He picks up a couple of kills here, but those are just consolation kills. But look at Shinsei already. This man, he has been a formidable force. Great shots there, traded towards Garage. Four versus four now. Maxi is gone. Crazy guy is out of this map, so there's no initiator to assist them with any sort of information. They've got Jake on the on the breach. He's actually able to just flash them in, but they have no idea where any of these players are. Easy, easy. Spike has been planted alongside the cosmic divide. Two players, Shinsei. And Redco is here, ready and waiting. They do have the concuss, they have the flashpoint, but Darion just super ready for that. They set up a full-on unit here towards Long. Redco will be able to take down one. He knows there's one more, and he does manage to spray him down. Jay, all by himself towards Long. Here we go. A great use of utility to clear things out. And look at Redco go. While on their side, Revry just cleans things up. What? A retake here coming in from LVR and does man. not know that there are five players here ready and waiting here for him. Phantom in his hands, but he just misses by a millimeter. Crazy guy will get the upper hand and they're going to be making their way in towards this site. Flash comes in, they, they have an idea. Redco is around here, but Redco does manage to take down at least one before getting traded out instantly. That has to be a save here from the side of LVR. And here we go. Bleed looking to get aggressive here towards A short. Bryce. He's got the Phantom in his hands, he's got Redco all the way up there, and just because Redco got scanned, he's not going to expect that Bryce is playing up close and personal. That's going to be a great shot, a great pickup. On towards Juicy, the Jet, on the side of Bleed. Clear out long, Crazy Guy has been spotted, but the rest of the team from the side of Bleed is going to be wrapping here in towards Short, and I'm not sure if they have a clue. They just don't know how quick they can come up here towards Short. Instantly traded out, and that's a two versus two. Shinsei, once again, not going to be able to have any luck with this operator. Always trying to find those opening picks, but he's in the wrong position at the wrong time. They choose to actually come in for this retake. Spectre in the hands of Maxi. Can they actually make things work with this? Not the easiest weapons to come in for the retake. But I'm sure they can make things work. Jet dashes in. She's got the shorty in his hands. And the Spectre actually makes things work. 
93 HP, 3 HP here on towards Maxi, and that's going to be a quick cleanup from Escary. Spike will be planted. 4 versus 5, remember that, ladies and gents. They do have a lot of utility here from the side of Reverie, Red Co. on that breach as well. Flashpoints, Concussion, and the Aftershock. Here we go, Bleed does take down Shinsei. That's going to be a great start. Looking for more. Not going to be able to pick things up. And look at Bleed go, just holding it down nice and easily. Hitting these shots, winning out the gunfights with ease. Legally Red Co. right now. And doesn't seem like there's much left in the tank. But there will be... A little bit more oh, just man. to end around. But in the end, Bleed is just able to win out those pulse times every single time. Oh boy. Oh. Great use of utility. Juicy takes down two and looks like they are on a roll in this defense. They know that the A side has been taken, but this frenzy is doing work. My goodness. <laughs> Looking for more. There's no way that they could basically handle the double frenzy no. attack. He's the one leading the fray. And now, before everything is set in sight, he okay. gets the stun on top of JH. And Shinsei goes one for one. Scary trades back. Juicy now. Only with the operator. Oh able my still goodness. Still on the lower angles. And Lou is going to be swarming him. Furion. Still make it pretty much clear. Down to Brian. Ooh. And HP. That's the way. Quick him. shots there from Bryce. I think they're just waiting for the scan uh, from Crazy Guy. It has come up. The recon will be coming in. So that's going to be the start of this execution. <laughs> just some chaos in towards this A side. They do spot out Maxi, oh, no. but he misses his blades. Maxi takes down two players. And LVR managed to hold things down here towards this A side. Shinsei is a bit dangerous. And look how he plays with that. He's not going to be able to get one, but he does manage to delay here. The defense, the retake from the side of Bleed. Slow and steady. Cosmic divides all around the board. Just so much utility. But in this storm, JH and Darion is able to come out together and pick up a frag. Oh my goodness. Right oh down. my, not like this. Oh boy. The retake comes in nice and easily. They use the wall to their advantage. And they just hold up a crossfire. God, who can react faster? And Juicy is the one to do it. Rolling Thunder does come out, and then he catches Redco as well, and they're cleaning things up towards Long. Three rest, three of the remaining players here from LVR. And there's not really much time for them to work with. Look at the flanks. Dereon's already on his way, and he's hoping to catch them mid-rotation. And for the time being, Seems like oh. Bryce is doing his due diligence as well. This angle right here, I don't if think they get this trade. It. 30 seconds left. Oh, snapped directly over on the D round. Couldn't really find him. Millie gets that hit shot. Two more standing away. As much as C gives them a little bit of room of possibility, it's still being held back by the rest of the esports. Scary just doing so much work here. 10 seconds here. left. Maxi left with so little. So, for the time being, believe that they're going to go in for a safe and Player hope standing. to pull it into the final push. With everyone pu pushing forward, oh, I don't man. think that he will survive. Maxi, Maxi somehow still carries oh, his weapon. I mean, with a quick rotation as well. Oh, look at that oh, combination. My. The Astra alongside the Darion Nanoswarm. Just beautiful. Pulling him in. Nonetheless, what a hold from the side of Bleed. LVR barely had seen anybody. And somehow they're up. Like, yeah, they, I don't think they've even seen anybody and it was a 2v4. Not at all. And right now with the lockdown in place, there's not a way for Louvre to come in quickly with the recoil. Oh, oh and Juicy goodness. will take the final member down from Louvre. And this is where Bleed Esports will get themselves the upper hand in the series. Defenders wow, win. what a round to end things off. 13 to 8. Um, so basically what happened was, in the start of the round, through Garage, Crazy Guy was able to get that Odin spray down through the nebula, through the door to take down Redco. Verdi got even two members over on top of Haven to actually look, look forward to it. And Aftershock does clip onto Scary. Shinsei with the first blood, and now he's hitting over on in the corners of ropes to see if he can find another opening. 
That's the kind of utility usage that LVR likes to pull off. They get Reverie to use that Hound to, to find out the position of Ascari in towards that, uh, in towards that uh, mail room, so not mail room, vents. And the concussion yeah. just comes out from Redco. Nice and easy picks. Shinsei dashes in, takes him out, and just perfect utility usage. And that's a massive, massive utility being taken out. That's scary, especially as the defending Viper just wrapping now towards that A site. Looking at how much space Luth is currently taking, they're just not leaving any room for Bleed to get in with the clear entries and crazy oh guy. Oh my goodness. Just keep providing him a little bit of a hinge of what may come, Player and we'll find a pick through the smokes, and Maxi gets a double as well. Maxi Only and Bryce. Only to JH. I mean, what can he do? It's a pistol round. He has to find a way to clutch this off, and there's already three weapons pointed at Go him here. if he goes into heaven. 78 HP and JH. Doesn't seem like he has a choice. Definitely. I mean, just a great hold coming in from the side of LVR. They should be able to close things out here. Bryce takes down JH, and that's going to be the first round, keeping four members alive from LVR. These esports opting to play it oh, cool and safe, and Shinsei immediately oh, aims for head. Gets that firm entry, and immediately comes in with the aftershock oh, as well. Both. But Crazy Guy was on point. Definitely what a shot. Good trade eventually here by Crazy Guy. He's looking for more. He picks up the second as well. Just instantly shuts down the offense, the aggression from the side of LVR. Two quick shots, but does he have an idea? Does he clear this angle? Does he spot out the barrel? He does, and he gets the Redco as well. That's the spike, spike drop. Down, He's B. looking for more. Two players left. Will he go for the eight? One, so one more to go. Just deleted this phantom in this crazy guy's hand. Makes it look like Odin. It's just so sharp, so strong, so powerful. My goodness. And what could Bryce Jackson do exactly down. at this form of point? Pray. He is opting not to give the ace away and <laughs> we're talking about this dude Toxin is popping off up. just like what his name says. He's just one orb Toxin away from getting his ultimate left. here. And it's just round three. Yeah. Impeccable work coming out of Crazy Guy. And eventually you take more time. Crazy Guy could even heal up back to 100% as well. Got some snake bites, but not that he could basically clear off this angle. Crazy guy's just got to lie and wait 14 seconds on the block. And Holy! there we have it. A delayed ace, but ace nonetheless. Exactly. So that just shows how important utility is. And look at the aggression coming in from Bleed. Beautiful oh stuff from Bleed. Juicy alongside JH was just able to secure that first frag on towards Bryce. And that's one of the controllers Holy down God. and dusted already. Scary gets the heal back up to 100, but he will lose his shields, though. They're still prying onto this mid sector where you're holding a bleed hostage for the time being. Keep their eyeballs up. And it looks like there is a little bit more of the pressure being pulled up onto the B. But this okay. middle room is being held by Scary. Doing it all alone with a double. And Luke's got to change their plans. There's no way that they're actually getting out of this life if they were to stake over onto the mid sector. But Reverie trades back, finds Juicy. Try to get the wall bang out of that. Crazy guy doesn't really have to opt for a revive. This still looks to be pretty much well secured. Damage being done towards Reverie, and they're still not holding back. It's an all out trade. Louvre. Looking like they have nothing to lose, and they will continue to push forward. Scary gets a triple. Spike down. Only down to Maxi right now. It's hugging him out of the corner of the wall. Grab the wall. Spots him out, and they finally stop this Viper from getting even more. Down to Scary Guy. He should be able to do it. And Therion nails it back. You can see towards middle. LVR has already taken that middle control, and looks like they're going to get aggressive here from this side of lead. They get the Rolling Thunder out. And they're able to take down one crazy guy. A great shot there on towards Shinsei. Here. Crazy guy holding this alongside with Juicy. Whereas Red Coast currently stuck over wall, waiting Here. for this aftershock to come back online. Uh, he does see a little bit of a window of opportunity to uh, push and shelf onto ropes. 30 seconds left. But the timing is impeccable coming in from Crazy Guy as he will slowly peel backwards. Forever the well being committed, and the rest of the looking for that full flush over onto this V heaven. And this is where the blind clips in. That will still be an exchange coming from Spike Juicy to get that double B. as well. 
Spike now down Ten below, and Redco wouldn't even be able to find Juicy. This quick flank from three players. Nonetheless, LPR are going to be making their way now in towards this B site. Shinsei trying to find an opening, but there's just no one to welcome them. And this crazy look at how guys. crazy guys just gets them through the smoke yet again. And they understood that they're pushing from heaven and they absolutely give way to them not being clipped by the Rolling Thunder. And scary finally arrives to the scene. Into the garages is where they are all being funneled into the site. And Darion couldn't get great going time. Oh, that's a great round there. Utility usage, the flank. Bleed just were one step ahead. It's really down to the battle between Juicy as well as Bryze, where he's lurking around, and that is being absolutely red. And same goes to Sensei with the snake bite actually clipping onto him. And this is where Scary will just seek him now. There's nowhere to hide for Lou for the time being. And now their hands are being forced to move directly onto the B side one after another. They falter, but Reverie at least gets one in return. Three versus four is still mat very much doable for the rest of move, but Therion okay. the angle long enough. Reverie as well as Maxi snaps it right back. Perfect timing. And now they really down. turn over the odds. Scary down, still making it difficult. Definitely Scary gets that shot off here to turn it into a 2v2. Spike will be planted here, but look at Juicy, just gonna go ham on towards that site. Misses the first few shorty shots. Redco has given away his information, but here we go. The Viper Spit's gonna be coming out from Scary. Gets the perfect rotation towards the back of site. Does he expect one more to be from that position? He has an idea. Does he spot away? He spots out the gun barrel. Yes, he does. And that 1v2 in the hands of lead Scary, making it look so easy, saying peekaboo. How are you inside that Viper's pit? Has been pushed out, got the information that A main is clear, so I don't think they're gonna expect all these players coming in towards A. Shinsei did manage to take down Crazy Guy towards middle, so that's gonna be a good start. They do spot out Redco, who's playing in towards that elbow position. Gets done, taken down to so little HP, 45 HP. Trying to do his best here with what he has, but scary just being able to pick up those frags with the ghost. One more here for him, looking for the 4k, but it's not going to be able to close things out. One versus two. One versus one now here. Two really dire attempt coming out, and then really down to Maxi is the plan goes up. Juicy's only at 22 HP, and he's wrapping around the corners of the elbow. Maxi should be able to spot this one out, but not what? flip enough. Juicy lands it. He was ready. My word. Juicy instantly blast packs his way over on the top. Needing to deal with the sky. He blinded ever so slightly. Preemptively checks all these corner of the box, and he does get the headshot off to referee. And now Crazy Guy is having a couple of clips of his own, but the rest of the will be able to solve oh this with enough. Okay. Crazy Guy, no. Oh, no. Okay, he's still surviving. And oh, that fully juicy comes through the wall. As well. This is where Spike down things a. really take the toll on towards the rest of Luv, only having Maxis to rely on. The final Phantom in the back. Just and even if he saves this round, it's not a guarantee that they could pull off a massive comeback. They won't get that free plan. And there's Spike really planted. much that Maxi could do about it. One versus four. Let's see if he can clutch. Uh oh. Durian from behind. Spots oh, out the gun barrel. Like takes them out. Just shuts down LVR. But what a round that was. They can easily wall this one up. Mains now sent into the bottom layer of ropes. And just like that, once again, denied any form of vision control for the rest of Luke. And that's where Scary Guy continues with the double. Standing. Crazy Guy is just insane. As a Sage picking up those three frags with ease. Full on aggression. It's Maxi once again. You can't do much. And Durion again going for that flank. I'm not sure if he's going to notice this. But he does manage to get three kills. 4k now, but it's going to be over as Darion comes in from spawn to close win. things out. 13 to 3, bleed with ease. A quick 2 0 series to start this day off.